Christianity thinks of human individuals not as mere members of a group or items in a list, but as organs in a body, different from one another and each contributing what no other could. When you find yourself wanting to turn your children or pupils or even your neighbors into people exactly like yourself, Remember that God probably never meant them to be that. You and they are different organs, intended to do different things. On the other hand, when you are tempted not to bother about someone else's troubles because they are no business of yours, remember that though He is different from you, He is part of the same organism as you. If you forget that he belongs to the same organism as yourself, you will become an individualist. If you forget that he is a different organ from you, if you want to suppress differences and make people all alike, you will become a totalitarian. But a Christian must not be either a totalitarian or an individualist. I feel a strong desire to tell you and I expect you feel a strong desire to tell me which of these two errors is the worst. That is the devil getting at us. He always sends errors into the world in pairs, pairs of opposites, and he always encourages us to spend a lot of time thinking which is the worst. You see why, of course, he relies on your extra dislike of the one error to draw you gradually into the opposite one. But do not let us be fooled. We have to keep our eyes on the goal and go straight through between both errors. We have no other concern than that with either of them.